What is going on guys, Miracle with Work Tech here and today what we have for you guys is a review of the Rosewell PB240 all-in-one CPU cooler. So when I saw Rosewell was actually branching out and doing an AIO cooler, I decided it would be a perfect time to try to get into contact with them to do this review. Uh, obviously there's a lot of different AIO coolers in the market for around this price range of $120. But let's see if it will stand up next to its other competitors. This is my air cooled setup. I had 320 mm fan bringing in air to the case, push pull setup with my Hyper 212 Evo, and a fan in the rear and top of the case to exhaust the warm air. With this setup, it worked pretty well and had no issues. My only complaint was that at full speeds, it sounded like a jet was taking off in my room. When we got into contact with Rosewell about the PB240, we thought this would be a perfect fit for how popular as AIO coolers are now. The PB240 all-in-one CPU cooler comes in at $120 and fits in the category of its competitors. The PB240 uses an advanced closed loop design that comes with a pre-filled coolant and a high power pump for rapid liquid, liquid circulation without worries of leakage or refill. The fans on this AIO are extremely quiet. I was very impressed when first powering on the system for the first time. The quiet pulse width modification fan is built to ramp up or lower your fan and pump speed, allowing you to get more control over cooling and sound. The tubes on the AIO that house the water are really great quality. However, they are a little stiff which makes installation and mounting a little bit harder. What makes it easier to mount this AIO is that the tubes connected to the block cooler is able to go side to side with the swivel so that you can change the angle that they are at. Overall, the CPU cooler is really nice. Installation was actually fairly simple thanks to the diagrams they give you. You will start off by putting the back plate onto the motherboard, grab four of the back plate screws and washers, put it in through the board, thread it so that you can see them looking inside the case. Next, place the black cylinders given through the plate screws. The next part is a little bit tricky. To help with this, I mounted just the radiator in place so it would hold in place when installing the water block. Once it is in place, take the spring-loaded screws and screw them on onto a snug. Next, use the external black screws to screw the radiator and fans into position that you want. These are gonna be an extended screw so that it can help you mount through your case through a single fan and onto the radiator. As soon as I installed the PB240, I instantly started to overclock. I got my 6700K to an overall 4.9 gigahertz overclock. Here are a few benchmarks and numbers that I did before using the PB240 and with my previous Hyper 212 EVO setup. Now, these numbers are going to vary because obviously I wasn't overclocking at 4.9 GHz with my Hyper 212 EVO, but hopefully this can kind of give you an idea to see what kind of improvements that you will actually be seeing with an AIO cooler like this. So guys, overall this cooler is fantastic. As you guys can see, the build quality is great, packaging is great, instructions are fairly simple and it's easy to install and you guys are going to get cooler temps on your CPU. I was never able to achieve a 4.9, 5.0 gigahertz uh, overclock on my 6700K with my stock push-pull configuration on my 212 EVO, but however with this guy, I was able to achieve it and I was able to get steady overclocks. Uh, no blue screens or anything. I'm hoping to go to the 5.0, 5.1 gigahertz realm. Uh, I still am new to overclocking, so I'm sure that there are a few things that I could tweak to try to get my clock rates up. But guys, I would highly recommend this cooler if you are looking for something. Uh, it is great, great build quality. For $120, you are looking at other competitors. However, you can definitely catch this cooler sometimes for sale for between $110 and between $100 and $110 depending where you are looking at. But guys, we hope you guys enjoyed this review of the, core, of the Rosewell PB240 AIO cooler.